Hey guys, welcome back to my channel today. I'm going to be showing you a thrift store haul of the things I have gotten. Um, kind of a life update. I have moved. I don't currently live in Florida anymore. I have moved to North Carolina and since then I have realized it's cold here and the tank tops and the crop tops and the shorts, they just don't work in the cold. They don't work in 50 degree weather so I had to go and get some new clothes and especially being on a budget I just can't go online and spend $40, $30, even $20 for like six sweaters because that just adds up and I just wanted to just get something that were, that was cute and would do what I needed it to do. So I have went to the thrift stores already. I literally I literally went to, I think, four or five, whichever one was in my area, I just went to. And I cannot believe how good these deals are. Like, they're not, oh, Goodwill's kind of like on the expensive side of thrifting. If you ask a lot of like people who are real thrifters, they don't like Goodwill because it's just overpriced. <laughs> but a few things I got from Goodwill, but the majority I got were just from like local thrift stores. And they were like, cheap like i could have went in to these thrift stores with ten dollars and i could have hit every single one of them and not have used all my ten dollars that's how like ridiculous this is and i love it so let's go ahead and jump in i'll show you guys some of the winter clothes that i have gotten from them the first thing that i have gotten was i'll show just kind of the accessories first i got these little knit hats and I don't know if this was just an impulse buy because it was just so cheap and I was like who cares if I use it I use it if I don't then I don't but I needed some type of like warm hat and I thought maybe they could be cute. I honestly I don't wear hats that often so I don't know if I'm supposed to wear it here or maybe a little bit further back but these are just like such cute little like knitted hats. But yeah so I got this one and then I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the other one I got. And then this was the last one I got was like a darker blue. It's the same thing as the other ones, but it's kind of bigger. So I kind of rolled it up at the front. But yeah, I don't know. I just thought I would try it. I'm not a huge hat person. I don't know. I find it hard to be able to match them. But let me know if you think this is a good thing I bought them or I probably should have listened to my fiance, forgot about them. But after he saw the price, he was kind of just like, whatever, who cares? I have a habit of thinking things are kind of cute, and then people tell me, no, that's that's really not that cute. So you guys let me know in the comments down below, yay or nay, because I, I need to know if I'm allowed to wear this in public. I also got this kind of sweater. None of these are itchy. I'm like super surprised, and I definitely tried to go for something that wasn't necessarily the colors I would go for. I was trying to look outside the box so I could get more things I wanted. So some of these I would never buy like the color of them, but they actually work and I actually really do like them. But it kind of has a little bit of a V and like a collar to it. It's kind of weird how that part is, but yeah, I don't know. I just saw this. This was part of a deal for two for a dollar. So I got these for literally 50 cents. And I had never been to a thrift store that was like that. So I was like, I, I have to find something. So this is kind of what I picked up. Like I said, this isn't something like color-wise I normally would wear. So there's this sweater. This one. This is kind of a high neck. It's like rolled at the front. It kind of has like a slight like wannabe turtleneck to it. So it's just nice to have something new and something that I just don't have a lot that can match with a lot of things. So that's what I got here. And so it kind of matches the other one. They're very similar, a little different, but I was like, who cares? They're obviously different. So I'm just gonna pick them both up. And I got this one. This is just your basic gray sweater. It's just something that I actually don't have. And I'm pretty sure it's just like a basic brand, like you can just get it at Walmart or something like that. But it's just honestly, I've worn this one more than any of the other ones. It is so freaking comfortable. These three sweaters and those two hats only cost me $3.75. Those sweaters were like buy two for a dollar or you just bought one for a dollar. And I was like, I'm finding another one. But amazing. Then... This one, which is the maroon, like, Nike long sleeve shirt. This one is from Goodwill, and I think I paid, like, $3. But $3 for a workout shirt that long sleeve fits well is really nice. All, all for it. I am 
all for it every day and this one oh, wow wow this one is like one of my top ones look how like fresh and new this looks it looks so good this is my first turtleneck that i've ever bought and at least this kind of style i've tried to buy turtlenecks in the past and they just don't work but this one i think is like super flattering but i love this color i love this blue i love honestly everything about it it's so comfortable i wouldn't necessarily wear them with these jeans but i'm already trying on so many things so I but this one i think i paid maybe like four or five dollars for so worth it though so now you don't have to get new sweaters i'm good for a while and i don't have to spend a lot of money this is a cardigan i've never been able to find a cardigan that i have liked that i want to keep so this is kind of like a beige cardigan and i have never been able to find a cardigan that i like or that i remotely want to wear but i tried this one on and i think it's pretty cute i kind of like that it's longer because it means it's going to keep me warm more i could just wear that with a tank top over and i would be fine if it was like 50 something degrees outside which 50 degrees isn't that cold but to me it is right now and then also what i am wearing right now is also from a thrift store this one i think i paid like a dollar or so for this one i absolutely adore it's a cute like little pink sweater and if you see there's like kind of purple and maybe some green in here with two little buttons but i think it's super cute it's almost off the shoulder so it's kind of like a wider neck but it is super cute and I can't believe someone would just give this away, but you know, old to them, new to me. So thank you. It's a wider V-neck, which is nice and it feels comfortable and it's just not as like restricting. I almost forgot to tell you guys, this isn't from a thrift store, but I just like couldn't believe I found these. These are from Belk, I think. I don't know. It's from a Bell's. It's from a store I usually don't go to. I can't remember. But I found these. Tell me how freaking cute these are. And they were only $14.99. They were $15 for these shoes. I don't... I would, I would have paid $40 for these. Are you kidding me? So freaking cute. Love them. The only thing is that they're a little bit heavy. I don't know. It's kind of hard to describe. But like when I'm working on it, it's not a big deal. I don't think I'd run in them. But for like weight training, it's perfect. But. Ooh, dirty bottom. Sorry. I already tried them on. You could see that I already used them. But. Had to show you guys that. It's not part of the thrift store. It's not a part of the thrift store haul. But you need to know that you can find good deals anywhere. You don't have to spend a lot of money to get what you want. So that is it for my thrift store haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video today. Make sure you give it a big thumbs up if you do. And if you guys have any requests or you want me to do a certain video on something, just let me know down below. I will start uploading frequently again. And I love you guys so much. Bye.